In SRA Number Worlds, you have three implementation options, a 30-minute option, a 45-minute option, and a 60-minute option. Each option allows you to teach students the standards that are key for them to be successful in mathematics, but with every option there are some unique differences. Once you know what option or implementation you're going to use, once you land on your teacher homepage, you're going to click Lesson Plans. Once you click Lesson Plans, you're going to select the option that's going to be available to you, whether it's 60, 45, or 30 minutes. In this video, we'll concentrate on the 30-minute option. For every lesson, you will have the objective, the standard you're working on, and one thing that's very important is creating context for either English learners or students with poor vocabulary. You'll also have a list of program materials that are important to this lesson. All the materials that are listed, listed if their program materials are included in your Number Worlds kit. If it's additional materials, those materials you'll need to provide for your students. Below the materials list has other resources that you'll need to teach a Number Worlds lesson. You can access your Teacher's Edition eBook, you can access the planner, and you can also access a letter to home. This letter to home is a great way for to have a connection between home and school, and it comes in English and Spanish. You can access every activity card. This activity card is important because it is the place where students will play games, um, talk about mathematics, and really build on the concept and skill that they're working on for that week. You can access the English Learner Support Guide as well as the English Learner Individual Oral Assessment from this page. The practice book, which will be the student practice book, as well as the student workbook. Other things that are important to note in this particular uh, page is the assessment. Each unit comes with a pretest and it can be accessed in PDF form from here. If you'll note that you continue to plan in Number Worlds, all five days are here for you. They all have a drop down menu. So if I want to know what I'm going to do tomorrow, I simply click on the drop down menu and the same thing appears. All of my objectives, all of my materials, all of my resources for that lesson. Let's take a look at your Teacher's Edition eBook. Your Teacher's Edition eBook is a direct replica of your print Teacher's Edition. This allows you to plan right from the eBook if you so choose to. You can have a single page view or a double page view. If it's a little bit too small, you can zoom in to see it more clearly. In a Number Worlds 30-minute implementation, you are going to stay focused on the Engage section. But I want you to notice you still have your objectives listed, you still have your standards, creating context for your English learners or for any student with low vocabulary, and you still have your materials listed, both program and additional materials. You will spend your 30 minutes in the Engage section on the 30-minute option. In the Engage section, you will concentrate on teaching the students the concept and skill through an activity card. These activity cards can also be accessed on your teacher page through the lesson plan. The activity cards contain games, hands-on activities that help students to better understand a concept or skill. Students will then practice in the 30-minute option by doing their student workbook pages. Those workbook pages are also listed on the right-hand side of your ebook. These pages are supported and independent practice for students. Students will have an opportunity to practice the concept and skill after they've participated in hands-on activities. During your fifth lesson, students will also do the Engage section in the 30-minute option, but they will also do an assessment. The assessment is a weekly assessment that allows students to practice and you can assess them on the skills and concepts that have been taught during those five days of a lesson. So this is an example of your Teacher's Edition eBook. Some other things to note that you can access right from this eBook is your glossary, zooming in and out, and then highlighting if you so choose to. This is a great resource for planning as well as teaching when you're teaching Number Worlds to your students.